Coming up next, it is a UFC welterweight championship showdown between Leon Edwards and Colby Covington. title fight in other divisions certainly doesn't at 170 pounds but now with all the contenders behind him there is one man left standing it is this man the number one welterweight contender now getting his shot at the dominant champion and he believes without a shadow of a doubt that he is the best 170 in the world and he is out to prove it right here right now challenger to date can he go back home as the champion if he can another chapter to one of the greatest welterweight legacies the octagon has ever seen event of the evening. Four years apart with similar height and reach. We send it inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas, the UFC Welterweight Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a wrestler, holding a professional record of 17 wins, three losses. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Introducing the challenger, Colby Chaos Covington. And now introducing the champion, fighting at the red corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 21 wins, three losses, and one no contest. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC welterweight champion of the world, Leon Rocky Edwards. All right, this is for the championship. You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it fun. All right, so here we go. This highly anticipated fight is now underway. Looks like a classic matchup of striker versus grappler. Am I simplifying things too much? In this instance, you aren't, because this is what got these two men to the show. Right. One guy is known for his diverse attack on the feet. The other guy is known for his ability to drag the fight to the mat and put his opponents in danger from the very start of the grappling exchanges. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. Looping left hand misses the target. 
Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Nice strike. Well, if you're going to leave your body that wide open, you're going to pay the price, and he certainly did there as his opponent. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Just misses there with the left. Whoa! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurts very bad. That's a nice one, too. Body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. Oh, straight right. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Planted and fired there. Landed to the body. Just over 20 total strikes and counting have now landed for Colby Covington. Keep your hands up. Use your footwork now. Okay. Head kick is blocked. Yeah. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Just over two minutes to go. Yeah. Trying to establish that jab once again. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Edwards gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. Got the single collar tie. Ninety seconds now to go in round one. Very tricky when he throws that body kick. Big Paul punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Nice body kick right under the elbow. How you with pace and pressure, whether he's wrestling or striking on the field. Yeah, I mean, he, it, it's his calling card, right? His calling card is for him to really dictate the pace, really push the pressure on you and hope that his opponents will wilt under the pressure that he brings. That jab is fast. Look at that jab. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Oh, nice connection there with a the punch, DC. Great time to land that punch. All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. Oh, an educated jab there. I could watch this dude jab all day. I mean, he's so light on his feet, and when he pops that jab, it comes right back to his face. Final seconds here. Oh, nice knee to the body. Just what he needed there. The horn sounds for the end of round one. Well, right, let's take a look back at some of the highlights from those previous five minutes, DC. And uh, no padding, no glove on that foot. No glove, no padding. And look at the hip action when he throws those kicks. He's not only kicking just for feel, he's really trying to damage his opponent. And as the fight goes longer, you will start to see it taking effect. All right, here we go with the start of round two. Leon Edwards versus Colby Covington. Nice punch land over the top. Powerful leg kick lands. Well, he's got the kicking game going tonight. Lands another one there. A beautiful kick, and all I can think of, better him than me. 
And he landed a nice hook shot there, DC. He landed the hook exactly where he needed it to be and threw it with ill intent. That's a really strong leg kick there by Covington. Big punch lands over the top. I was gonna follow this one up. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Nice job by Leon Edwards going to the kicking game now. Certainly earned the respect with his hands, now changes the level. Full on mixed martial arts. Yeah. He can do it all. He's a fantastic striker. A guy that can mix it up. A guy that knows exactly where the opening is and isn't shy to take that open. 46 total strikes have landed for Colby Covington. And landing at a 54% clip tonight against Leon Edwards. Ooh, what a punch. Yeah. Right hand upstairs. Missed with that attempt. Lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swelling. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Oh, tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Covington. All right, under three minutes now to go in round two. Well, he has really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive than we saw in round one, and now starting to find himself in the pocket. Let's focus. Let's focus Tried to set up the straight left, but he missed. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Big body kick lands. Great punch. Outstanding, and you saw a great example of that just there. And you see his opponent starting to slow down. He cannot take many of those kicks. Blocks the strike. Oh, pretty good handiwork on the feet there from Colby Covington. Doesn't get enough credit for the striking, but it's certainly on point tonight, champ. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. And he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by him. Great connection. He's in a great flow right now. Oh, he lands a massive kick here. All right, 45 seconds now to go in the round. Thirty seconds to go in the round. Oh, he continues to land a high number of strikes in this round. Really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. Certainly have to be mindful that you don't gas out, but you gotta like the output on display here. Edwards gets hit by that leg kick. May not be a bad idea to start to check some of these. Big kick land. Oh, that straight punch. Knocked his head in the wrong direction. Really putting his opponent on notice. And that's the end of round number two. All right, a lot of high-level striking action in that last round. Daniel, take us through it, if you will. Tit for tat. Who has the best chin? It seemed as though they were looking for that answer. Both guys took risk. What a fantastic round. Ready to fight. Ready. Here we go, third round of this championship fight. Straight punch lands. 
Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Just missing on the high kick there. And that left hook landed on the button. Head kick. Big punch lands through the middle. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Edwards. Oh, that right hand is on point. All right, lands a kick there. Pretty well done. Really good accuracy landing that kick. Oh! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. Got clip with the right hand. Oh, buckled him there. Beautiful shot to the body. Oh, big punch lands. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. <laughs> Just out of range with that left hook. Ooh, blocks the shot. I need you to go forward. Big roundhouse now, just misses. Oh! So 89 total strikes have landed for Leon Edwards. Well, on a pretty good connection rate thus far, hitting on one out of every two, the accuracy rate is 50% against Colby Covington. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. We have just reached the midway point of the fight. Covington's lower jaw looking extremely swollen now. Able to land with that punch. Edwards gets touched by that kick right to the body there. Nicely done by the opponent. A oh, little single collar tie there. Nice kick landed there by Covington. Clipped him with the right hand there. How good is that right hand? Two minutes remain in the round. Oh. Just missed with the straight left hand. Edwards gets hit by that kick to the midsection. You gotta do better defensively. Misses with that punch. Real quick leg kick. Good punch. The next with a right. Oh, roundhouse. Talk to me about that kick. He is throwing his entire body into that kick to the point that he turns all the way around before he can face his opponent again. Right punches there. All right, one minute to go in round three. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Oh, and he continues to pour it on. We mentioned earlier the aggression with his striking. Got to be careful to not gas out here, but at least you have to admire the approach. Oh! He's out! Wow! What a performance! Just an absolutely gorgeous shot to spell the end for his opponent. Crowd is absolutely loving it. He gets the near-perfect land. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming, but just the way he drew it up here tonight, saw that little crack of an opening and barged right through it to get the knockout. All right, we'll take a look back at the highlights. You know we're going to find that nasty head kick somewhere in this highlight rip. Just an incredible result for him here tonight. A very nice head kick to finish the fight, but don't ignore all the work he did with his hands and give credit to the opponent. The opponent was in there every step of the way. And in order to get a fight of the night like he got tonight, both guys have to be willing to participate.
Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 34 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout and new undisputed UFC welterweight champion of the world, Colby Chaos Covington. So there he is, the newly minted UFC welterweight champion. You had to look far and wide for people who were picking him in this spot tonight. As Dominic Cruz said, when you became the double champ, he got it done. Not many people expected him to win. Those three guys that walked to the octagon with him were sure that he was